Hey everyone, welcome back to Windless Effort Plays. Friggin' Stardew Valley. I'm picking up exactly where I left off. Just like straight up right where I left off. No other things have happened. I was gonna eat some cookies and then I looked at the cookies and then I and then I remembered that I probably shouldn't be eating cookies right now. <laughs> probably not the best of ideas. So anyway, today, 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 today. Two day, three night. Um I think what I'm gonna do, actually, is I'm gonna go... Oh, nice. I'm gonna go to the mine. I am going to go to the mine, and I'm going to see what all I can pull out of there. Preferably at least enough materials to have five, um, five copper bars. That's my goal. That's my goal. I might as well just keep this. What's this? What is this? Oh, you can change the color of the chest? Oh, that's so cool. For color coding, for sorting purposes. Dude. Okay, that looks like a ghost. Huh. Gotta keep that in mind. Anyway, I'm not gonna worry about that now. I don't have enough storage, enough anything to store to make that worth knowing about or caring about. Going into the mine without a sword might be a bad idea, actually. Can I even go into the mine yet? No, wait, I can't. The area to get there is blocked. There was some construction on that bridge, so never mind. That's not even remotely relevant right now. Ne never mind, never mind. Ne never, never you mind. I need to find six more people. I still need to get this parsnip. Unless this is my last day to get a parsnip for her, I should be fine for that. Shoot, if it's raining, I might as well get a bunch of fishing done. Copper. <laughs> Granted, a bunch of fishing doesn't really work super well when your inventory is minuscule like this. I need that. I wonder if there's anyone who actually dislikes dandelions. There might be. You know what I should do? I should investigate and see if I can find out what it is that people do and don't like. Hmm. And well, this is all who all I have left to visit, huh? don't even remember exactly where to find a bunch of these folks. Should probably save the gold star to sell. That's a good amount of, that's a decent amount of profit right there. So here's a dilemma. Should I be focusing on saving and selling these, dandel these daffodils? Because, you know, inventory upgrade? Or should I be focusing on befriending villagers early in the, uh, early in this game's, uh, lifespan? It's tough to say, honestly. Regardless, regardless, I want to go investigate the mine and see if it's accessible. If I remember correctly, and I like to think I do, it is currently inaccessible. But I want to see for myself. Hmm. I'll find out shortly. I'll find out. Just scrap it. I don't want a rock. I'd rather have a leak. <laughs> yeah, okay, so this was going on here. Which I don't even remotely remember how to how to alleviate that situation. But it's there. I gotta work with it, and that's fine. Let's see. I really, really need that backpack upgrade. The fastest way to get that much money is probably fishing. Just straight up, probably fishing. Ooh. Which means I'd have to go all the way back to the home base and drop off all this stuff before I can actually get that fishing done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me the daffodil back. Those are mine. I just needed space to get a book. <laughs> I let's see. So I guess for now I'll head home. Drop off as much of this stuff to sell as I can. And then fish. Do a bunch of fishing. Try and get that fishing skill up. Fishing is still a good way to get money. Like, it's definitely one of the most effective methods of obtaining profit in this game, as far as I can remember, anyway. Hmm. Uh, we'll see what I can do. Anyway, 
I could be saving the daffodils to, um, to do the thing that my brain just shut down on me about. I could be saving them to, uh, to give to people, but that sounds, that sounds like a pain, so I'm not gonna. <laughs> is my sort button? It is. Sweet. Now, as for fishing, I wonder if there's any value in fishing in these ponds. As far as I can recall, most of what you get from those is trash. Trash and trash, and, like, just a lot of trash. Which certainly is not appealing. As though that weren't obvious. As though that weren't obvious, right? You can go away. I'm just gonna go do some fishing down here, uh, down south for now. I don't have any, any bait, actually, which... Puts a little bit of a damper on this, uh, on this endeavor, but that's fine. I just want to catch some fish. Get a little bit of money out of it. Eventually, of course. Eventually, I said. Thank you. God, this is so much more tedious than the iridium, iridium pick, or iridium pickaxe, huh? Iridium fishing rod that I had in the last farm. Oof. Note to self: get used to the tedium. Get used to it. Some of these activities are fairly tedious, and that's just that's just the nature of things. I think for now, I'm probably just gonna drop this in the in the crate to sell stuff. I don't know if that negatively affects people's perceptions of me, but it's useless to me until I have a means of recycling trash, which I don't currently, and I don't have a means of creating that either. Hey, you. Stop. 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 Stop moving. Yeah, these fish are going to get me a pretty decent profit, I think. Pretty decent. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my, okay, you are... You're a feisty one! Jesus Christ! Nuts. It's familiar, isn't it? Some fish that I just can't stop. Can't catch them. I don't have the resources. Tragic. What? Oh, are you... Are you seriously another one of these, these nerds? You are! Stop! Be an easy fish. Be an easy fish. I just want a bunch of chubs. How's that sound? Just a bunch of chubs. <laughs> Man. Or some green algae. That's fine, too. What the hell? Oh, it... Uh, <laughs> my door just opened itself. Because it's windy outside, and my windows are open. And that must have just created some kind of air current thing that nudged the door open. Goodness gracious, this is so much more difficult than I remember it to be. At least I'm getting some fish. That's the important part. I wonder if looking at the map, my new farm layout um, mirrors what it shows. I should hope it would. It'd be kind of baffling if it didn't. Yeah, yeah, you're a jerk. I see. I see. Okay, I'm not going to get as much money as I was hoping, because I just can't freaking catch some of these things. They're so stubborn. But that's this, this is how you get your fishing skill up, so you can catch them. That's the idea. That is the idea. I keep overcompensating when I make these these motions. Because that, that bar moves so quickly. I took my hand off the mouse for a second, and I regret this decision immensely. A fishing bar moves so fast. 
on this old fishing rod. This is bamboo, isn't this a bamboo fishing rod? Yeah, bamboo pole. Man. Okay, I don't know what you are, but I like you. You're, like, at least mildly cooperating. Kind of. Another chub? Sure. It's gonna take me a few more days before I can get up to 2,000, but as soon as I do, man, oh man. Life is gonna be so much easier. That's fine. Green algae is worth like 15, something like that. Cool with me. It's just more money. It's like 15, 11, somewhere in that range. I forget what. Hello. Nice. Anything good, I wonder? Please be something really good. Could it just be like a diamond? Ooh, some bait. Actually, that's that's really handy. Oh, and some coal too. Um sure. Trash is trash. Bait. Can I not put bait on a bamboo pole? Maybe I can. Oh that sucks. Alright, well whatever. That's that's strange. I thought I thought you could put bait on a bamboo pole. Maybe you can't do that until you get the next the next uh, next strength up in the fishing pole family. That would make sense. Unfortunate, but it's cool. I mean, I don't mind. Go ahead and store the bait for now. Sell all these, sell the, the fish and the algae. Those I have no reason to hold on to. Although I could give, I could like give one of them to, to Willie or something and make him a little more of a friend. But, eh. <laughs> Instead I'm just gonna chop, I'm just gonna chop down a few more trees. Chop down a few more trees, call it a day. Sounds like a plan. Continue to wait impatiently until I can actually freaking get my upgraded axe. Soon. Soon, 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 soon. <laughs> I don't think I have enough, enough energy left for one more tree. So instead, let's take out some more of this brush. Just, just work, just work on clearing out the farm on the farm space. It'll all get cleared eventually. I just gotta, just gotta keep going. Maybe gather some stone too. Might get a geode or two out of it. Oh nope, never mind. Starting to feel exhausted. Sure, that's fine with me. Hmm, let's see. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna plant this. I am, I'm gonna sell the sap. That's a decent amount of profit right there, actually. Those are worth two a piece. That's another 168. I don't know how much the pine cones are worth, but I don't really think I have a reason to keep them right now. So I'm gonna sell those too. And you know what else I'm gonna do? I have access to so much fiber. I'm just gonna sell this too. I mean, I'm not, like, getting huge chunks of money by selling these these particular resources, but it's money. And I want to get the backpack upgrade. There we go. Level up to fishing stat. Oh, wow, that actually got me enough right there, just in this day. Well, almost. I think I'm just a smidge shy of 2,000. Yeah, the fishing definitely was a good idea, that's true. That's That's for sure. Ah, they are 15 apiece. I know it. Cool stuff. I think I'm just like a tiny, tiny bit below 2000. Right? 1994? Oh, come on. Oh, hey. Hey, Clint. 
What's up? Yup, I have. That is true. Thank you, I appreciate that. I'm gonna need those. I'm gonna need a lot of those. Hell yeah. Thanks, dude. I appreciate it. Yeah, no kidding. That is a goal of uh, mine. Do I have enough materials to craft one now? <laughs> no, I need a lot more copper to be able to do that. I kind of feel like I should make a campfire just for the sake of, like, theming. Hmm. Well, first things first. Okay, I didn't, ha I didn't have enough time to get a parsnip for whomever that was, I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't mean to be so neglectful of the quest I accepted. I just kind of was because, <laughs> because timing didn't quite work out. That's fine. Happens sometimes. Okay. Good stuff. Now this, this might seem like a, well, I just now formulated a plan of what I'm going to do for at least part of this day. I'm going to go go down to the ocean. It's Thursday. Okay, good. I'm going to go down to the ocean. I'm going to catch like one fish. I'm going to sell it straight to Willy and that will give me just enough money that I will be able to buy the backpack upgrade. That's my whole goal right now. Inventory size increase. Down to the ocean. Gonna go down towards Willy's shop. Sit on the pier. Pick up an oyster. Good plan. Anything else to... Oh, that's a clam. These are worth a little bit of money, too, so I'm not gonna turn them down. Actually, I might be able to... When do you open? You open at 9. Okay. Mumble, mumble. Want a clam? You're welcome. Now, while you're just chilling, and while I'm waiting for you to open your shop, I'm gonna catch a fish. I might even be able to just straight up- I could just- Actually, I could just sell the oyster. <laughs> I just seriously just sell the oyster straight to him, but... I, since I'm here and I'm waiting for him anyway, I might as well try and catch something. Might as well. Whoa. Nope. No. Stop that. Halibut. Cool. Catch another one. I mean, this is this is this is just money I'm going to get for the sake of money, so I might as well. And I believe I have immediate access to buy an upgraded fishing rod. Fairly certain, if I remember correctly. Yeah, yeah. Let me in. All right, dude. Oh no, I can just buy a bamboo pole. I'm gonna sell that. Sell that. Sell that. That halibut was worth a lot of money. Damn. Cool stuff. Let's go to Pierre. Let's buy a backpack upgrade. Let's forget how to get back to town. <laughs> Good plan, right? Good plan. Great plan. Who said that? Tiny Tina said that. Good plan. Great plan. Borderlands. Yeah, that's fairly accurate. Yo, Pierre. I know you're not o I know you're not closed today. It's Thursday. Quartz twice the market value delivered directly to me. Um I don't have a means of getting the quartz. Thanks. Thanks, Pierre. I needed that. I needed that very badly. Hi there, also. Yep. Mm, I could buy some seeds, but I'm not going to bother just yet. Anyone back here I can meet? Abigail, I've already talked to. Weird shrine thingy I'm going to ignore. You I have not met yet. Hello. Caroline. Okay. Yep. Abigail is the one with the purple hair. I love how that's the distinction she makes about her own daughter. The one with the purple hair. <laughs> how much is the next one? Yep, 10,000. I'm... I was remembering correctly on both counts, although I was a little bit off on the first one. Alright. 
what next? <laughs> There's so much to do. I still have three people left to meet. One of them's a wizard who comes to me. I don't get a, ch a chance to meet him yet. Oh wait, never mind. It's just these three. What's her face? This dude and Haley. Okay. I don't remember where I can find Haley. She lives in one of these two houses. I know that much. I can't imagine she's doing anything in particular right now. Oh no, I want to see Sam playing video game or that's not video games. Playing a uh, music musician's guitar. I just got two guitars? Damn, dude. I'm impressed. These are definitely references to something. Those posters on his wall, they've gotta be. No idea what they are, though. Let's see, where's, uh, where's Miss Nudie Pants Haley? I have absolutely no idea where she is, or how to find her. Which is part of the trouble of this whole introduce yourself to everyone in the town. Oh wait, there she is! Hey you, Blondie. Yep, I'm the new one. My clothes are fine, thank you. And also my hair is prettier than yours. Gosh. Red hair is so much cooler than blonde hair. I'm sorry, I... I have, I, I think that red hair is cooler than blonde hair, but that's just a personal thing. Don't, don't for a second believe that I'm implying that all people, all red haired folks are, oh, that was a weird skip. Oh no, please don't tell me these recordings have been skipping like that. Oh, that would kill me inside. I thought I had all the settings right. Maybe I don't. That's not, that's, that's trouble. Hello. Ragged, but so cute. Okay, I'm gonna have to go over the footage here shortly and, um, pray that these two episodes have not had weird skipping trouble. Who else is left? Uh, I need to meet. Is your name Sebastian? No, no, Sebastian's that, that emo dude. I don't remember your name. Or your name. Where do I? Oh, I know where the, I know where the kid is. Little purple hair girl. I know where she is. It's purple, right? I'm not mistaking things. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's like slightly purplish black. Long hair, bro. I have no idea where he hangs out. I know where his, where his bungalow is, but I don't know where he is. Which is trouble. Honestly, if I, like, re if I were really invested in meeting this guy, I would seriously just stake out his house and wait there until I see him. Anyway, this kid... What's her face? If I remember correctly, she likes to hang around at this one tree over here and uh, jump rope. Yeah, there she is. Hey, kid. Oh, I'm sorry. But it... Have I met you now? Have we met? We have. One, two, three, four. Oh, no, I messed up again. I don't understand. Okay, sure, that's fine. I mean, I don't get it, but okay. One, two, three, four. Oh, no, I messed up again. You know what? I'm so close to getting that introduction quest done, I might as well just go stake out his house and watch. As soon as I see him, go say hi before he, like, bolts inside or whatever. Because what else am I going to do with today? I mean, I could clear out the farm some more. That's that's really all I've got to do left. It doesn't really, it doesn't really feel like there's too much of a point to that. Yeah, they do. <laughs> Pleasant. I like your perspective, though. It's a, it's a good one. Elliot, that's your name. Alright, Elliot. I am seriously just gonna sit back and wait. Tear out some sand, why not? I'm gonna give you a... I'm gonna give you a path to your house. Just because. Who knows, maybe I'll find something interesting. <laughs> and I missed entirely. Dag nabbit. That's fine though. Easy fix, just go around. Can I not? Elliot. 
Get back here. Just fish for now, I guess. Can I not fish right here? No, maybe I can't. That's that's curious. Wild. Well, I need to talk to you. I need to talk to you, Mr. Longhair. So whenever you feel like showing up. Nah, screw it. I'm just gonna sit back and wait. Whatever. Whatever. Do some dash dancing. Practice some practice some movement in Project M. There you go. Hey, hey. <laughs> the lengths I go to to complete these quests. Oh, you can walk all the way. I feel like there should be a secret up there. Some kind of area you can visit or investigate. Where is this Elliot dude? <laughs> Playing slide whistle with a bamboo fishing pole. Good plan. I will wait. I have already been waiting and I will continue to wait. Can't stop me from being super invested in talking to this dude. Mm. Sorry, I just gotta stretch. I haven't stretched yet today for some reason. I've been awake for three hours. Ooh. That stretch gave me vertigo. Oh, there he is. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. There we go. Yup. Yup. You with your terrifying jawline. You want, a, you want a daffodil? I'm sorry. You don't like daffodils. Gosh, what a jerk. I don't care. Whatever. Alright, I done it. I met everybody. <laughs> need to craft a furnace, and I need to grow and harvest a parsnip. <laughs> what a shame. You'd think that you'd think that a writer would appreciate a nice flower. I thought he would. I'm like mildly disappointed actually. That's fine though. I wonder if giving people gifts they don't really like actually negatively influences how they how they feel about you. I hope not. See, that's that's part of what kept me from trying to become friends with people last time, other than all the other reasons I gave. It's just because, like... Oh my god, I am suffering from allergies. Just thinking back on it, like, it's one of those in-retrospect situations. I don't want people to feel bad of me, and if I give, if I give them something they don't like, then that's, like, uh... I feel I'd feel like I messed up and I don't want to I don't like feeling like I messed up That does not sound like a good time to me Also, I'm sure you can tell I'm just gonna straight up use the rest of my energy to tear out a bunch of rocks I'm hoping I can get my mining skill up to level one and in doing so Maybe that was part of how you unlock access to the mine. I don't remember But I'm gonna try anyway I definitely hope it is Nice. Definitely would be nice. And I think the number of rocks I tear out today should get me to that point. 12, 10, so that's gonna be 8, 6, 4, 2, and that's enough. <laughs> I know when to stop. I know what my limits are. Kind of. Maybe. Sort of. Alright, let's do a little bit of inventory cleaning. I really, I really gotta take these geodes over to, to Clint and see what's inside of them. Could be something cool. You never know. I went a whole day and didn't sell anything? What? Who does that? Anyway. Mining skill did not go up. What a shame. I don't even have a sword. Alright. I want to thank you all for watching. I will see you in the next episode of Stardew, of Stardew Valley. Excuse me while I go investigate the footage and make sure that's not screwed up. I really hope it's not. That would suck. But, uh, yeah. I'll catch you later.